Hello everyone, welcome again and uh, today I'm going to show you another project in um, Java. So it's grading system uh, for the student of Parasite calculations. So um, let's talk about the technology at the very first what we are using in this project. So we are using Spring MVC and Hibernate. So Spring Hibernate, uh, Spring and also it's Maven project. So as you can see the bomb.xml. So it's using a Spring, MVC, Hibernate, uh, and uh, uh, to manage the database, it's using Workbench. Also, you can see the MySQL Workbench. And uh, to deploy the application, we are using Tomcat. Okay. Uh, so the server is not there. Okay. Let's run it over my Tomcat. I have already configured everything, and uh, I'm just going to run it and show you the demo how it's working. Also, uh, as I cl right click on the project, and I click on the run as, and then I uh, select my Tomcat server here, and I click on the finish. So it will launch a welcome screen. So also, if you need this source code, you can contact uh, in the description box. You can check the link. So that link will redirect you to detail uh, information about the project and the technology that we are using the functionalities features also I'm going to show you the demo in a while and so you can take the source code and also you are worried about like how you are going to run that project at your machine so we have a remote support so remotely our team will help you to run that project at your machine like uh, how can you set up the database how can you set up the ID how can you set up the servers how can you run it so till the end will uh, make it run at your machine okay so let's move to the home page <clears throat> so here is we have a home page and before uh, like uh, let's understand the database before I start it uh, so under the user um, in my database and the user we have one data here which is called admin so let's log in as an admin and check different different functionalities how the things are working over there so there is a login id for the admin and password is admin321 as I log in here as an admin I have a authority to add a student and I also I can check the student list here I can check the students from here I can add a student so as an admin you can add a new student into the database so you, uh, to add into a student you just need to fill out these details and click on the save button also you can check the list of students uh, if you want to click on the view detail it will redirect you to view all the details related to this student like view courses view course detail like uh, student payment detail student result details so uh, you can check all the detail of that particular specific student also here we have a op option to edit the data so if you want to edit some records for this student let's say i'm going to change this name and data is updated successfully uh, <clears throat> also you can search uh, a student by name and email id the so search option is also there and add course to student so if you want to add any course to a student you just click on this to add a course to a student you select the student name and select the course name and then save so now you can check the list of courses according to the student so these are the course name these are the students again we have a edit button here again we have so we have, we can edit the data records and we can delete it we can search it by course and by student another important module of the application we have is a teacher so as an admin you can add a new teacher in the database so you just need to fill out these inputs and click on the fill the save button it will add the data in the database uh, there is a teacher list so you can check the teacher list so when you click on the teacher list this page will come and again we have option to search teacher list by name uh, by id again we have a view detail page for the teacher as well so you can check the teacher so like teacher course details so what that particular teacher going to teach so it's enroll in the mc course and you can see the view details so what students will come under this teacher so this will show this detail here this student will come under this teacher and the course detail and other detail things like a student name session name mark and everything course detail already also it has an option to edit the records here 
okay so teacher this list is done now another option we have add course to teacher so like as an admin you can add a course to that particular teacher so let's say bca so i add a bca to that particular teacher also i can check the list and again the same option similarly as an admin you can add a new course you can check the list of courses here the same function is there to view details and you can check the detail of the course like what user is what uh, teacher is going to uh, teach the teacher how many students are enrolled there all the details are, details are there okay so as an admin you can add result you can check the list of result also you can perform the edit delete all the crude operation over there also uh, another module important module for the admin we have as a payment so uh, as an admin you can manage the payment you can check the list of payment you can check add a new payment particular student name so data will come here automatically uh, also the lo location mo module is there so you can add a new uh, location and manage all the data related to the location and you can add a new schedules for that particular course name or something like for them i'm going to add schedule for the mca and the location i just start date and i fill this input details and escape okay schedule list other common option we have here is a my profile and change password you can see so now the admin is done and let's dive into the teachers teachers table and log in as a teacher what teacher can perform over there so these are the teacher uh, data table and uh, in this data you can check all the details that display in the front end when we log in as an admin so teacher will be there we have another option uh, another, another table is a student table so data will be display here whatever the data we are entering from the front end it will display here other option we have is a sign up option so we can sign up here, here as a new user so let's say i sign up demo user and I say demo at the rate one to three as a password some 10 digit number it's mine I'm gonna save it has saved successfully now if you're gonna check the user table I guess yes so new user is there now if I log in to this user, it will again work as an admin. So this is the other another admin agent. So you can as a school or as an admin, you can manage all the details from there, all the complete grading system. So like teachers can check the details, like you can check details on the, all the teachers or the subjects. So you can manage complete grading system, like complete system. So it will be easy to maintain. So thank you so much for watching. If you need this source code, you can take with uh, us if you also we have other services like if you wanna learn a complete project development from us uh, we'll provide that to you like complete training program also you can get the certificate it's all the things that depends on your um, performance like how you perform it performing uh, under the course so uh, you can take that uh, like opportunity as well like if you wanna learn these things if you want to prepare for an interview and i really suggest this is a good project for a major project or, or for any interview purpose if you are preparing for an interview you should understand this project this kind of project so you can easily crack the interview like the when you are going to as a fresher going to work with any company they will surely ask you to some questions from the project that you have done in your final year so you should know about these things in detail before um, dive into the interview directly. Thank you.